Riders will be looking for the number one. Kyle Wyman, the defending champ, can he defend here at Atlanta? The HD Screaming Eagle team has been hard at work to prepare these bikes, and it is evident in the lap times that Travis and Kyle Wyman have been doing. The Harley team, they've been fast. I mean, they're like five or six seconds quicker than they went last year. They've made measurable improvements that for this track really count. This track's definitely more physical, not as many breaks. You don't get a lot of time to just kind of sit and catch your breath. These guys getting ready to line up because they had their second qualifier literally just about five minutes ago. $5,000 on the line. Three laps, it's gonna go by quick. Let's see how they can fit two of these big bikes in a tight area. Ooh, and there's Kyle Wyman up in the second spot. He's got one oh, more spot crunches. to go and he pushes too hard. Down goes Wyman and the Harley Davidson hits the floor. Oh man, and it comes to that point, did he ground out before and it just kind of slide out from under him? I made a pass, but kind of got a little overzealous in there. I was a little bit tight for the right, and I kind of just threw it on its side, and I just decked out on the on the engine case and lifted both wheels off the ground, and that was it. Unfortunately for Kyle Wyman, too, that wasn't the Mission King of the Baggers race. That was the challenge. He's going to have his chance to get it back going again tomorrow, and I mean, that's the big race. We lost the bag and a couple of bits of bodywork and an exhaust and a peg. It didn't cost us any points, which is the big thing. We did work late, but it was worth it. If you thought that the Michigan King of the Baggers would be a snoozer, you would be wrong. <laughs> uh, the Harley Crew's got that bike up and going, and I'm, I'm sure he's going to give it his all today. It would feel really good to get this win this weekend and make everything right in the world. Just get the job done. Lights are on, we're rolling. King of the Baggers here for Michelin Raceway Road Atlanta. For Spoley looking for some room on the 43. Look at Hawks Spoley go! So James are Spoley on that Vance and Hines racing road glide. Now we got this battle at the front between Raspoli, Kyle Wyman. Come on, get out front. Raspoli nearly loses it. Here we go, here we go. Kyle Wyman got that run over turn five. He slides himself up underneath Raspoli into turn six. Yeah! yeah. Let's talk about. These two guys actually have created a little bit of a gap. Kyle Wyman coming to the white flag, so there's gonna be one lap to go. After falling off yesterday in a huge disappointment, Kyle Wyman has it all in his hands again to start chipping away at this championship. Into the final corner we go, down the hill for Kyle Wyman. Here he goes, your national champion will come across the line and win here at Michelin Raceway Road Atlanta. I'm just so happy to do it for all these guys up here from Harley-Davidson Screaming Eagle. They deserve it so much, and I'm so proud of this motorcycle.